Not too long ago, some agitated youth of Zogbeili in the northern region took to the streets to vent their anger over an ongoing construction and drainage system which is almost complete. However, the said road is already in a deplorable state. Following this, unit committee members of the area have added their voice to the call for action. Speaking to Adwan News, chairman of the unit committee, Mr. Muhammad Suleimana, stated that the gutters being constructed are substandard. As regards to uh, the construction going on in Zigbeli electoral area, yes, which, which is the, the works that the contractor is giving us is not the best. A lot of short works have been done. Things that we're not expecting, that is what we are seeing. What I see? It's like the gutters that they are constructing, they are substandard. The mixture of their concrete is not there. At side, they don't use any poker machine to compact or to vibrate the works that they are doing. They don't have any... The, yes, they don't have any dimensional signs. So they are discomforting the people of Zogbeli. And even they have started excavating the road, starting feeling the graveling. When you go there, the kind of gravel that they bring is not, it's nothing to write home about. Yes, it's substandard gravel. Okay. So we are calling on the urban roads engineers to come to the site and make sure that they test the kind of gravel that they are putting on the road. He stressed that the gutters are shallow and cannot contain water during rainy seasons. Hence, has the tendency to breed flooding in coming years. He said the outcry is not for the contract to be terminated, but rather a call for quality job. We are not saying the contract should be terminated. We want a quality work, no matter who comes to work for us. We don't, we don't, we are not even talking of termination, but we want the right thing to be done. That is our concern. So we always come to talk to them about the kind of work that they are giving us. The foreman on site. At times, we even have we even have the video footages. Yes, to our credit, we have video footage footages to as regards to the work, starting from the the iron rods that they are using, and the kind of the intervals is not is is bad, and we have pictures for all those those things. Okay, who cannot tell because he employs them. And he, I don't know whether he even has a foreman on site. Because ever since we are here, we have never met any says that we want a quality work. If he, if he give us quality work, we will not have any problem with him. That is just the, the, the works that we want from the contractor. The we want the very yes. Even some of the gutters have started leaking. leaking. Yes. You go to, you go to uh, elsewhere, you see a gutter with electric pole. An elder in the area, Chief al Hajna, speaking to Adwan, you said. Yeah. Nobody votes MPP more than Zogeli electoral area. We vote MPP more than any other electoral area. So when a job eh, is given to our chairman, eh, why wouldn't, wouldn't we be happy? But we are not happy with the shoddy ways that he's exhibiting. So that is why we are lamenting. When we called him for a meeting with uh, our uh, able uh, unit committee members and then... Uh, Zogeli uh, Assemblyman, he said, he said to the whole community, he just mentioned it to the whole community that this project is not a community project, that it is a political project being eh, emanated from electoral co coordinator, Inusa, that an MPP uh, members came here for a meeting and they were anointed and they removed their car ties. That's uh, gave the area contract uh, that gave the area project uh, th this kind of project to be exhibited and we are saying that if any MPP members who are in other areas want development then anytime they see MPP car moving in their area or their environs they should try and seize that car and remove the car ties or bend the car so that it can also enable those communities to get the same project that we have gotten because if a chairman, an able chairman should speak this way, and they have given you a project to do, that is taxpayers' money. And then you are saying that it's not uh, coming from what? Taxpayers' money. It's coming from your own packet. Mm -hmm. He said that That's this rubbish. project, uh, he is using his money to do it. So we are lamenting to government to know whether this project uh, 
is going to be paid by taxpayers' money or is going to be paid by Chairman Samba's money. 